to mark the Marathon Recycling Day in the United Kingdom. Cixins in London, Liverpool and Manchester clean up the environment around them. Meanwhile, during Cixin Week at the National Penghu University of Science and Technology in Taiwan, Cixins got some hands-on learning at the recycling station. But first, we join Sun Yongkun, a dialysis patient in Malaysia, who is doing his part in sorting recyclables despite his disability. Getting out of the car with difficulty is 54-year-old dialysis patient Sun Yongkun, whose legs were amputated due to a bacterial infection. Despite his disability, he looks forward to his monthly trip to the recycling station to fulfill his environmental mission. <laughs> When I sort recyclables at the recycling station, time passes by a lot quicker. When I'm at home, I just watch TV and not much more. It's very dull. Knowing the money earned from selling recyclables helps to subsidize medical fees for dialysis patients. Swin does his share to help. After we separate them, the selling price is much higher. The money earned can help others who need dialysis, but can't afford it. This is good because everyone can contribute in their own way. It was city volunteer Huang Suling that encouraged Sun to get out of his house and participate. The money earned from selling recyclables assists our dialysis patients. So I had hoped, since he's a dialysis patient as well, this will strike a chord with him and open up his heart. Although Sun has difficulty getting around, with a heart determined to do good, nothing can stand in his way. Meanwhile, also visiting a recycling station are Taiwan's Cixins from the National Penghu University of Science and Technology. At 2 p.m., the day is hot, but these university students do not forget their appointment to protect the planet's resources. <laughs> students are careful to separate the recyclables into different categories. Prior to the event, Cixin Fan Cai Qi posted an invite for her internet friends to join her. Today, she herself has gained a new perspective. We cleared out about two or three bags of beverage cups. However many drinks you buy a month is how many cups you're using up. The top is aluminum foil and this part is styrofoam, so it needs to be separated. It's not enough to just help sort recyclables. First-time participant Zhen Qingyang is determined to set an example by using reusable cups to reduce waste. I will try to use reusable cups, but if I use disposable ones, I will at least clean them out so that volunteers have an easier time sorting them. Besides helping to sort recyclables, MPU's Cixing also held a banquet with 18 delicious vegetarian dishes. Unlike previous years, this year everyone was asked to bring their own utensils. We're spreading vegetarianism while promoting environmental ideals, so we asked everyone to bring their own utensils and bowls to use. At MPU's Cixin Week, young students are helping to make a difference in the world. Moving to the United Kingdom, on a recent sunny weekend, Cixins in London were busy beautifying a park. <laughs> Fighting over who gets to pick up the bottle, these Cixins joined Cixins in 12 other countries in taking part in the worldwide Marathon Recycling Day. It's not only us that are participating in the clean-up. Liverpool and Manchester are participating too. I think it's wonderful that everyone is taking part in different areas, but doing the same thing as it brings us closer together. I feel blessed. There's no division of race or age when it comes to protecting Mother Earth. And even passers-by, like little Gracie, were eager to help. We encountered many little children who were curious about what we were doing. Of course we explained what we were doing and invited them to help clean up the park with us. For those skeptics, Cixin take time to thoroughly explain the event and their mission.
it's nice of you to come to this country or live in this country as people from another country to help this country and deal with this rubbish problem, basically. I felt like this cleaning up was in a way clearing away our impurities. We can be cleansed and return to our pure nature. Marathon Recycling Day is no longer just a model for these Cixings, as they and others like them strive to keep the planet clean for the next generation.